Hello everyone, this is Emerald Lupin, and I'm back with Epic Battle Fantasy V version 2.0. I'm going to start the fourth... One, two, three. Yes, the fourth optional dungeon in this game, the Crystal Caverns. And we get one brick and one copper pipe. And one earth ball. Okay. Oh, I see. You have to go around the other way. What's this? Those were the spiked boots. Huh? Why do we have to leave our boots behind? Beats me. There's probably no reason. I just picked a random item. Uh-huh. Right. What's in here? Three satin, six silk, hat, bunny ears. Become as quick as a bunny. Gives the player haste status occasionally. That's a hat for the girls. Let's see... One earth ball, one bone spike, and let's see. Aha! Two amber, four silver plates, two gold plates. Good. Smash these. If I remember right, yes! We get two rainbow ore, four more silver plates, and 20 butterfly wings. Let's here. Three gash root, one emerald. Which way to go then? Left or right? Left or right? Which way to go in the crystal caverns? Let's go this way first. What's this? These ruins. What's this? These ruins have been preserved so well. <clears throat> Let me try that again. What's this? These ruins have been preserved so well. This is incredible! I can see now why we had to leave the boots. <laughs> More ice puzzles? It was a trap all along! Oh, poor Matt. Yeah, and you need the big hammer to get through here, so... And we get one piece of glass shards. Yeah, if you don't have the big hammer, you can't get into this dungeon. Or at least this half of it. One ruby, one glass shards. Oh dear. Ice puzzles. Uh, that's not good. Um, I don't know how to do these. I'm actually gonna... Ooh. I should have looked up a video on how to do this before I started the recording! <laughs> uh, why did I do that to myself? I don't know. Okay. Um, I'm gonna pause for just a second so I can find the right video to help me with this because I'm gonna have to look up how to do this. No joke. I'm just, I'm not good at this. I fully admit that. So I'll be right back. And I'm back. Uh, apparently the creator himself put up a video on how to do this. So let's see. Okay. This is going to be slow, and I'm sorry about that. I would have made my own notes on how to do this, but I found the idea of making the notes to describe this process very, like, how do you describe it in text in a 
and make it clear enough so you're probably getting what I'm saying, right? Okay, so like that, and then we'll... Okay. Come on, like this. Dang it. Shards, flash shards. Okay. this okay that's one four liquid ice six solid water one sapphire okay here 12 metal gears 16 copper plates and gun accelerator manipulate space-time to your advantage manly slow down while attacking okay and no element okay <sighs> it forgot to mm, focus and two pizza one orange juice one cake good okay there and 11 14 20 snowballs there we go are they drawing energy from these crystals was I doing it wrong it's the crystals that I should have been collecting not the monoliths and another one Ugh. Okay, five snowballs and six sacred runes. All right. Let's see what I'm... Talk to the NPCs after I'm done. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, one hamburger, 12 coffee, one chocolate milk. Good. Ah, oh, dang it. <sighs> well, I can get on the way back, apparently. Three snowballs, one sacred rune. Okay. I think there are only two of these puzzles in here. Okay, so we got two sapphires, three emeralds, and bow. Emerald Cyclone, a weapon that harvests that harvests the power of the wind. Boosts the damage of wind skills. Okay, good. <sighs> Marina. This old temple seems to be extracting power from these crystals without destroying them. We usually just burn them up, burn them for heat. So maybe we've got a bit, maybe we've got a bit to learn when it comes to renewable energy. Where's all this crystal energy going? That's probably not relevant to the plot. At, that's probably not relevant to the plot at all. And neither am I. Ouch. Pandora, we're not the, we're not the only ones collecting crystals for their energy. There's plenty of monsters down here too, because of, because of course there are. There's always dang monsters around. <sighs> and they don't even give it EXP down here. Sigh indeed. Oh, there's a three-headed dragon between us and that huge crystal. Hmm, which do I value more? Wealth or health? This situation is indeed suboptimal. It would be better if there were no dragon. Yeah. Uh, what you gonna do? Screamer! Four. Four waves, that's, um... Wow. Sacred land, there's a chance of getting good luck or regenerating between turns. Pulsar! Sand Dune. Actually, Blade Blitz. Nice. Death by snow cats. That's that must be humiliating. Oh no, it's charging. I don't think it's gonna get a chance to let off that attack. What I tell you. Bonk. Star Blast. Mm. 
demon swords. Pulsar. Swift Slash. Uh-oh. You siphon no legs. That's not very nice. Thank you, Maxi. Strange unknown dog. Surge. Thunderstorm. It's not to fry your circuits. Give me those. down. Uh-oh. Not good. Well, there goes Natalie. Good thing I have, like, gallons and gallons of coffee. She's siphoned. Come on, no legs. Oh, 45 accuracy down, 45%. Oh! So much for that. Why do you keep letting me die? I'm sorry. Okay. First, get Natalie up. Heal more. Bold boogie. Matt's alive. Barely, but whatever. There. <sighs> Die! That was kind of tough, no legs.
you first. Ice Storm. Jesus, think of this ice cream cone. You know, this game seems a bit silly. <laughs> Get rid of you. And you can melt. Geometry! Show of your mathematic skills, no legs. You missed. Pulsar. Ow. Shards. Shards of sh glass. Really sharp shards of glass in the face. Aw, oh, that dog is adorable. Geometry. Bubble ring. Chickening out already. Okay, let's get rid of the rest of these things. Demon swords! Oh, right. So what are they weak to? Holy and bomb. Okay. Energy barrage! Energy barrage again! Blow these gloops to pieces. A. 
and peel another one. Blast it, no legs! Die! Take that bullet to the face! Feel the pain from razor sharp ice cream cones! And Natalie's dead. Sorry, Natalie! And Natalie's down again. Why do you keep letting me die? I'm sorry. Nice. to treat these golems like mini-bosses and focus some serious damage in their direction. Noted. Well, I have been focusing serious damage in their direction. Like that! Is that serious enough for you? Yeah, that's serious enough. Time to break you guys apart with the power of erosion. Aww. Sorry, I thought I heard something. Die. <sighs> okay, so all that's left is the boss. And let's see. Right, there's a medal for beating it on Epic. Okay, oh, I should also apply it right. Let's do this. Give no legs more HP. Okay, but this video's been going on long enough, and um, I'm gonna save the boss for next time. So until then, this is Emerald Lupin playing Epic Battle Fantasy V version 2.0 with the first trek into the Crystal Caverns. Uh, and uh, remember, if you like this video, uh, please remember to press that like button or leave a comment and tell me how I'm doing. Or um, consider subscribing to my channel or just sharing this with your friends on social media. My channel can't grow without you guys doing those sorts of things. And I can't fight the YouTube algorithm without you guys doing those things. And they, they really... They really do help, so please consider doing those things. And I'll see you guys next time with more Epic Battle Fantasy V version 2.0. Bye!